First, you're going to unplug your machine, take the vacuum bag off, you're going to flip it over carefully. You're going to take the four feet off and the eight other base screws for the base panel. Once you have the screws off, gently remove the base plate, set it aside. Once we get the cover off, we're going to go ahead and take our power supply out. It is imperative at this point to go ahead and check again that your machine is unplugged. You're dealing with 110 volt power. So the first thing we're going to do is take our power supply brace off. Got two screws, two spacers, and the brace itself. The next thing we're going to do is cut, if your power supply has it, a little tie wrap that holds the two incoming connectors together. So there's a little tie wrap. I'm going to go ahead and cut it off with some nippers. I'm going to now unplug these two connectors. I'm going to unplug this one right here. best way to do it is just kind of rock it back and forth until it comes out. I've got our three connectors off. I'm going to go ahead and take the last two screws out. The handy tip is to make sure that you have a magnetized bit so that your screws stay on the tip of the bit. At this point, we can lift our power supply straight out. Now this power supply, we have two different versions of the power supply, and the same hardware is used for both of them. Uh, so no matter if you have the green one or the yellow one, the uh, disassembly procedure and the reassembly procedure is exactly the same.